Well, happy Friday, my trucking friends. Hello, my truck, you mother truckers. Hello, Brad Shoemaker. Truck you, man. Okay, fair enough. Alex Navarro. Big Mother Truckers is a different game and one of the mm. first games I reviewed at GameSpot. And let me tell you, it is inferior to the product we will be playing today. Get, well, we're going to the truck out of here. Mm -hmm. We're going to be playing American Mother Truckers. Yes, damn right. Simulators. This is Patron's Choice, folks. You yes, voted. Yes. Here we they have are. some options in front of you. Here the, and today, here, here are the patrons. Yes, yes. That's right. And this is our Mission Control and Mysterious Benefactor patrons. Uh, you you voted today. for us to tr truck you off. Uh huh. Yep. That's uh -huh. right. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. A big, mm -hmm. uh, big truck and thanks to all of our patrons out there and everyone who voted. Again, you could go, well, don't vote. You can't vote for this, but next month you could vote for a patron's choice over at patreon.com slash next lander. Now, or just that, next .com. You can just get there from there. Redirects it's for true. now. I did, that doesn't really mean anything. No. No. For now, though. Or does it? Mm -hmm. Or does it? For now. Anyway, Alex, you're going to truck. Yes, and you're going to truck with me. You're not going to truck alone. What fun no. is trucking alone? Convoy, baby. Convoy. Oh, we're going to so, get a convoy? A couple things to set up here. Vinny and I are already in the server. We're ready to go. If anyone mm -hmm. wants to join us, uh -huh. it is up to eight players, and uh -huh. I have set up a server called Next Lander Trucking. The mm -hmm. password is snowman, uh -huh. all lowercase. Uh -huh. If you want to join, you're welcome to do so. You got to come find us, though. We're not going to stop for you. You got to come <laughs> find us. And we are right now in Bozeman, Montana. That's right. I, I cannot lay claim to this one, but you guys are truck buddies. We're truck buddies. Yeah. 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 We're yeah. We're more than friends. We're kind of just like truck buddies. Like yes. when, I, when I see Alex, we like the truck. It's very casual. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't take it too seriously. And we can. I, I truck, truck. You truck. We truck. I, I can truck Ooh, with, with whomever I want. Yeah. I truck with other people. Yeah. Credit, yeah. credit to Hex Sean for that one. I, yeah. It's good work. Also, uh, uh, to avoid any sort of DMCA takedowns today, I'm going uh, to be playing music that is either from a band I was in, a band I have played with, <laughs> or a band I am friends with uh -huh. that I don't think will sue Ooh. us for playing their music. Uh, so that is how we're going to keep things a little bit more copacetic today. We ran some risk yesterday with that Need for Speed stream. Well, Let's not do two in a row. I was going to say, on does, my does end, game... I, I'm mostly just going to play Metallica, ACDC, and the entire uh, Need for Speed Unbound soundtrack the entire time. So we, oh, should, you're, we should you're be answering fine. you're answering you're answering my question right here in front of me. I was going to ask if the game itself lets you play stuff, and it sure does. It even has flak support. <laughs> yes, it does. Flak I and see. MP3 support. So, so get ready uh, for some ska and some hardcore punk and maybe some other stuff. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, okay. All right. Sure. So, uh, Vinny, I've I've lost audio on my end. That's okay. Intentional. There it is. Uh, and we put it up. So if if it does get taken down, we'll know who to blame. Alex Navarro. Yes. Ooh. Wait, can I see that hamburger again? Check out that hamburger. Wow. Dude, wait, that's like three hamburgers. What the? Man, yeah. you are loaded up and ready to go. <laughs> uh, I got all kinds of stuff in here, man. Check out my little dangly got, got cactus. Your, got your cooler full of road sodas back there. Yeah. Uh, Mr. V says, uh, how is Vinny not breaking out the track IR for this? Yeah, I didn't, I didn't bust it out for this. I, you know, I might eventually take it out, but uh, we're going to mostly stay on Alex, your screen for today. And I'm, I'm going to just gonna convoy along. Something uh, going on over there. Are you? I saw a car flipping up in the distance. Are you? You doing no, all right? I'm just parked. I'm just parked, man. All right. You want to come over here? Hell yeah, I do. Let me uh, just drive over to where I am. Okay. Let me see if I can find where you are. Uh, what's I the see you. What's the horn? Button? You're, you're backing up, but I yeah. see you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I should be backing up towards you. Yep. Oh, I see you. Let's get a let's get another camera angle on that. Using my mirrors. Very nice. Very nice. So I think the goal Alex, today. I just, it's I been just a, want you. To, I just want you to know, to know that this ride is bitching. Thank you. I thought it was pretty bitching. Bitching. All right. Uh, so so here's the plan as what's, I am seeing it. What's I want to try and find a job to Texas because okay. the two biggest states that have come recently are Montana and Texas. That's so true. why don't we drive from Montana to Texas? Doesn't that sound like a great idea? I mean, they are two big states. Yeah. So as let's well. go to the freight market here and let's see what we can find. So do I have to take the same job as you? Is that how the convoy works? 
I want to say when we did this when we did this last time, it mm. might auto ask you to like, do you want to take this other job, this job that they're already taking? If I've got the license, right? I think so. Okay. But you could also just follow behind me is the thing. That's the thing. That's the thing. I could just run back. I got the cooler in the back. I got a dog sitting next to me. Old Kirby dog sits sits next to me. My life, I'm here to truck. It's my truck and I'm here to truck. Let me see something here. Because there was also this, uh, these external contracts, which are... I think there might be some stuff to Texas here. Yeah, okay. So there's one to Austin, one to Brownsville. I had, uh, speaking of trucking, hardcore trucking, I had to buy uh, cage nuts for my server. Uh-huh. I couldn't, couldn't find my cage nuts uh, okay. for, cage nuts? For, for my server rack. Yeah. They're like truck nuts, right? But then I did find them, but then I bought some more rack. cage nuts. I need to work Ooh, on We got one nuts. to Houston. What do you like, Austin or oh. Houston? Austin. Oh, it's like the Austin square nuts. <laughs> That's right, my square nuts. Oh, man. God damn it, I need a rack so bad. Yeah, I mean, my my your my truck your is a rack. <laughs> that's 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 the bumper uh, sticker I will get one day. Is that my, my truck is a rack? Uh huh. My other truck okay. is a rack. So which one? Something I do? Which here one is I do? happening. It's loading something. It might be loading me into a spot where I'm picking up this job. Okay. So do I? This is an external contract, and I think this is part of. Uh... Okay. So we're both here. Wait, Wait. I'm I'm not here. Well, no, you're here, aren't I'm you? Here. Well, I still see you in my convoy game. Is yeah, that, I see you. Well, we're fine. Okay, but I don't know. So if we I have, have to drive job. to go get the trailer. Right. Do you not see the uh, the menu? Uh, I don't or think I, like the the GPS. I don't think I've got the job. Okay, so here's what you do: go into yeah. external contracts. Yep. Yep. In the in the jobs menu, and Dead. then uh, pick the one to Austin. Okay, uh, Bozeman to Austin. Yes. Can I just search for Austin? Let's see. Are there a lot of them? There should be. If you go to the external contracts, there should just be one job from Bozeman to Austin. Okay, here we go. I'm looking. Okay. Okay. Catch him. Man, there's a lot of truck simulator now. Yeah, there is. Cody, Great Falls. Helena, Butte, let's see. Alex, does this thing have a radio display? Is there somewhere you can like put up what's playing? Like I don't GTA know if style? it lets you do that from MP3s. If anyone wants to know oh, what that, band it is, I'm happy to just tell them. Oh, that, would, that, would, that, that works too. That would be great. They should they should put they should put ID3 support in here. Yeah, so this is the last two playing. songs have been by this band called The Conspiracy, who were a uh, ska band from Petaluma, California that I used to really love. They have not been together in a very long time. but So I don't see that contract to Austin, but I do have one to Dallas. So maybe I'll just take that one and drive along with you. Okay, we might be picking up at different places, though, is the thing. It's okay, I could join you on the road. I mean, it's, right. from, it's from Bozeman to Dallas. How far away could they be? Uh, They're kind of far from each other, but that's okay. Dallas, Most well, of the way will be on the same thing. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I, I thought have there was like an option that let you take the same job I did. I can try and check the uh, before I do that. I can try and check the uh, convoy menu and see if it lets me do it from there. Okay. Um, I am in your convoy. Also, how's the music volume? Is it too loud? Too quiet? Let everyone let me know. Okay. I don't want to overbear, be overbearing with it. You know, it's, it's hard for me to find you on here. Progress skills, truck dealers. It, it just might be a thing that I don't have the... Uh, uh, the what Use, Music is a tad... Sorry, music is a tad loud, I'm told. Okay, I'll turn it down. Um, yeah, I, I'm going to take a different job. I'm going to take a, a, a job that Fine. takes me to... Fine. Uh, Fine. <laughs> Well, I, in the interest I, of, because I figure like last time we spent a lot oh. of time trying to figure this out. Do, do you have a third? Did that just see? I could also abandon this job if we want to do something else. Okay, hold on. Can you go back to that screen you were just on? It looks like you have a third trucker here. Oh, we do. Top. Someone joined up. Jam is on the server. What's up, Jam? I don't know where they are, but 
Oh wait, here you go. Okay, so go into the convoy browser uh, okay. and click view and take the same job. Where is the convoy browser? Uh, in the bottom, on the bottom menu, there's a button called convoys. Okay, yes. Oh, actually, no, sorry, go to the session. Go up to the top okay. menu, session. Session. And on sesh, there, you should yes. see the job that I have, and you should be able to take it. You need That's to gain the following was. skills, long distance five and fragile cargo. There's That's your problem. My, there's my problem. Well, here. Okay. You know what? what? Let's just do what you can do. Okay. So you want me That's to take the I job? Say. Take the job. Take whatever job you can take. Take this job and shove it. There's jam. I see jam. Jam. Yeah, I'm not as experienced a uh, long hauler as you. A truckist. Yeah. All right. So, gonna, so how how how? Sorry. How how exacting is this game? Like, do you really need to like do it right to get the money and stuff? Can you not? Can you not just GTA it? I guess is what I'm asking. So you can GTA it to a certain degree, though you get a lot of penalties for like running red lights or speeding past you know too far past the speed limit and all that okay. kind of stuff. Okay. Okay, so there's straight-up traffic laws. Interesting. That's cool. Yes. Okay, I took a job in El Paso. Okay. There's Jam. Hi, Jam. <laughs> jam. <laughs> All right, we're bringing some dry Big fruits jam. from a Bozeman to El Paso. All right, once we have our jobs picked up, let's pick a meet point, okay. and then we'll start driving to Texas together. Okay, my trailer is ready. All right, th so I have the job, Alex, if you want to take the same job now. Oh, okay. Let me see. Yeah, let me let me see if I can probably abandon that job and take this one. I'm gonna go get my trailer. Yes, I'm abandoning that job. Cause you can take and anything then, I have. Yeah. Oh, now we got four people in the server. Yes. View and take same job. Done. All right. Dry fruits. You gotta bring dry some fruits. dry fruits. Well, dry fruits seem like a good thing to truck. All right. Yeah. No spoilage right. to worry about. No. Uh, I've got a really bad GPS person right now. Okay. So, I, okay, I've got the GPS to that spot. We're all set to go. All right, I'm heading over. We're convoying up, folks. Hey, Jam. Jam, we follow. Convoy. Uh, we follow. Oh, yeah, you're already at the traffic light. Yep. There's, is, math, um, there's an is, astronaut in front of me. Is, is eight the max? Eight, eight is the max for a server, yes. Interesting. It looks like Jam. we have Nick A in the server as well. Or if you hit eight. Welcome. Yeah, if, hey, look, we can get eight people in here. I say let's do it. We'll have a great big convoy. Trucking through the night. I don't think I've I don't think I've ever even seen one of these games played extensively before. I'm like kind of excited to fill in a gap in my knowledge here. Oh, it's pretty Jim. much exactly what you think it is. Which is to yeah, say, like it is a very slow-moving driving game. <laughs> sure, but yeah, that's why I was asking about the the, the, the traffic laws because it seems like it seems like if you're in this game, you're here to like do it right. Yes, right? damn it, absolutely. Uh, I'm also I'm also curious what their what their sense of scale, like geographical scale, is. Oh no, I'm cutting the light. Crap. Fuck it. All right, I'm going. Reckless abandon, my friends. Ooh, Jan, you merging? Jan's merging. Okay. Uh, I am playing with a mouse and keyboard. Alex, you're playing with the controller. Yes. Every time I play this game, I want to do. Uh, I want to get a, a wheel. Playing with that stick shift in the office was real fun. Having turning signals and the whole thing. Mm hmm. Uh, I was in the Discord yesterday talking to folks and. Uh, I did order a vertical mouse. Ah, oh, shit, I just took the wrong turn. Discord channel. Oh, man. Oh, what? I'm seeing vertical mouse chat all over the place <laughs> for some I'm reason. I'm going to do something highly why. illegal whoa, here, whoa, my whoa, friends. Whoa, 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 I was following you. I'm hitting the brakes. I'm backing up. <laughs> this is bad. Everybody was Fucks following you. Fucks to the you. law. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, uh, is, that just a, is that just an ergo thing? Yeah, I bought it for because my wrist has really been bothering me. Uh, I think I figure if I can get three or four different type of mice, just use a different one each day. You know, get a yeah, trackball, sure. a vertical mouse, my regular mouse. That works. It's probably works. the variety is pretty good. Jan, I'm gonna let you merge here. Jam, All right, we made it. Jam, jam, jam. Okay, Ixnay. I think I'm fine. I'm, I'm, 
I'm finally gonna go wireless mouse, I think. Oh, it's funny, because on the vertical mouse, I bought it wired. I, was, I wasn't ready. No. I You're wasn't ready. ready at the time. I'm not ready. The mouse, the mouse is literally the last cord all the way across my desk at this point, and I kind of want to just get, full, I want to get to cord zero. So your keyboard is wireless? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's I use one of the Apple Magic keyboards, the Bluetooth mm -hmm. one. Is all right, Blue we're almost at the pickup point. What Bluetooth? Oh my gosh, this guy. Man. Someone causing problems? Me. Okay. Let me know if I need to kick anyone out of the server, all right? I don't want to do it, but if it comes down to it, I no, will. No, 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 no. knows. Ixnay saw what happened. Listen, there was a truck that didn't didn't want to... Uh, oh, an NPT? A non-player truck? A non-player non truck that didn't want to stop as I was making my left onto this uh, fine road here. So what are your, uh, what do you, what do you got your settings at here, Alex? What do you mean? Like, what are you, um, what is your, uh, uh, truck settings? Are you on automatic? Are you on, uh, simple I'm automatic? on automatic. Okay. Like, simple automatic. The one where it's like, you have to put it in manually into, um, reverse or, uh, neutral. But other okay. than that, it's... All right. Let me know when we're, uh... Okay, I'm backing up. Oh, look at all these, look at all these things to pick up. <laughs> There's only Whoa. one that's ours. I'm just going to switch to mine for a second. Kind of, look, at, look at everybody picking like, up their stuff. Yeah. Is it just like snap on? Snap on. Well, there's a button you have to press, but yeah. Whoops. Okay, I'm going to I'm gonna snap on here. All right, I got it. Jam got his too. Once I'm out of your way, go for it. <laughs> What's the air horn button? Uh, my, I, I mean, again, oh, these are all mapped controller. to different things. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a ruckus out there. Some stuff going on back here. That just it sounds like a train. There is a train going by. Hey. <sighs> all right, I'm ready to haul. Wait, what's the? Um, oh, I forgot what the chat button is. Gosh, what is it? Chat button is this, buddy. Nice. That's all the chat you need. That's all the chat I need. All right. I think we're ready to go, Alex. All right. Let's convoy up, folks. Let's get going. All right. Jam wants to. Jam, do you want to take the. I, I'm going to take the lead if y'all don't mind. No, you take the lead. Go ahead. Fall in line behind me, buddies. This is a lot. I may have to. I may have to take a nap soon. Just FYI, but this is a. Uh... I may have crashed into a car, but I don't care. <laughs> when you're how, ready to how, go. How does one? How does? How does one nap? Like at a uh, rest. There are rest areas. Rest, rest area. Is that, is that the best yeah. place? I guess. Uh, yes. I love when traffic has this. Hey, 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 car! Got a bunch of trucks pulling out here. What the hell are you doing? Do they, do they typically just, like, recline the driver's seat and just nap right there at the wheel? Some have the sleeper cabin, right, where you can go up in the bunk? Yep. Oh, above, wow. the, above the back of the thing. Wow. Oh, to be a trucker with your loyal dog just crashing on the highways. Yes. In, in severe debt, possibly, because of the uh, contract. Okay, yes. Fine. Take all the romanticism <laughs> out of it, by all means. Trucker life is a hard life. I know it. Gosh, those stories that would come out about losing money on a trucking haul because of uh, the way the contracts are set up are really depressing. Mm -hmm. All right, we have 1,300 miles and 24 hours currently scheduled for our All trip right. here. Uh, We're going to probably have to stop a couple of times along the way for gas, napping, and what have you. Now, Jam and everyone else on the server here, I have no idea what your stats are. I can't hear you. I don't know if you need to nap or get gas at any point. So if you do, look, we're all headed to the same place. We'll find you eventually. Some kind of log jam happening here. I'm going to do something highly illegal, folks. What? Oh, somebody just got fined. Who crashed a vehicle? Not me. 
$480 our convoy just lost. Isn't this legal? No. Not even remotely. Did you guys go around all this traffic? I just did. Oh, boy. Wait, there's a truck coming up on mine. I'm going to try and merge through here. Okay. I'm going to switch over to mine for a second here. See if we can get this merge. Okay. Oh, man, this truck. What happened over here? Some bad stuff, man. Also, yeah, my, my sleep status is now red, so I have to find it the next rest stop. Oh, I didn't realize they forced you. Yes. I mean, it's a thing you can Boy. turn off in the menus, but if you want the real experience, man. This, this really is a simulator. Yeah. Okay, I'm past the traffic. Uh, let me know where you pull off, Alex, and I'll uh, I'll try okay. and uh, join you over there. It'll probably be somewhere along this highway. Do 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 do. I am getting tired. You can hear me yawn. Ah, the nice open road. I gotta find the cruise control button. Maybe it's C? Or is that crouch? Alright, Jam is keeping pretty good. Keeping pretty good formation here. Shout okay. out to Jam. Seems like C might be cruise control, so. How fast are you going? What's your speed? I'm currently doing about 65. Cruising speed. You guys in? You guys in visual range? I don't think I am. I think you you might be a little, little further. I'm a little ahead. further ahead, I think. Yeah. I'll see if I can jam's catch right up. behind me. They have regulators on these trucks. Define regulator. Yeah, I see can jam back there. Can you go over 65? Oh, drifting. I think on the online servers they might regulate that stuff a little bit more. Okay. In terms of limitations. Anybody in our chat a, a trucker? I know uh, I know some people who listen to the podcast and stuff are. God, I could get through so many podcasts if I was a professional trucker. Okay, there's a rest area coming up on the next right up here. So I'm going to hit it. Yeah. Okay. God, I, I feel like I would just be mainlining audiobooks if I were in that position. Totally. I would just be white knuckled the entire time, given how much stress I have when driving. All right, pulling off here. There's one okay. right along the highway. Okay. See on the map, so I'm not that far away. Okay. All right, I'm pulling in here. This is like when I would ride bicycles with Matt Rory in San Francisco. Dude would just take off. Wait, why is this not letting me sleep? Do we all have to sleep? Is it like a like a, like a survival oh, game? That'd be server? really what? That would be weird. I don't think that's the case. Well, because time passes, doesn't it? It's possible I'm just not positioned right here. Hang on. Weird, it's not letting me. I bet we all have to sleep. That can't possibly be the way this works. Because there's too many people on this server for that. I'm gonna go pull, I'm pulling in. All right. Oh shit, I lost my trailer, hang on. <laughs> oh, this is all going wrong. It's all going terribly uh, wrong. All right, I parked. How did, yeah, how it's not letting me do it. Trailer. <laughs> I accidentally hit the wrong button. That's 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 how. I'm gonna hang out for a second, and I'm gonna look up. Uh... Apparently, at some point, I hit the uh, the couple button and the uh, <laughs> the shift button. I just want to sleep. How do I sleep? I want to let me sleep. 
No sleep I'm so till tired. Uh, no sleep till Brooklyn. I have to say, uh, I drove across most of the great state of North Carolina a few weeks ago. Got some nice ass rest areas out there these days. We like, got like water features. Ooh. Get and out of like, this window to sleep. What does that mean? Walking paths and stuff. I was like, man, I could just like hang out at this rest area for a few hours. What does get out of this window mean? Jam, thank you for trying to help. I just don't know what you mean. Oh, it's why it's the why he was talking about the uh, chatting. Oh, get out of this oh, okay. window. Get out of this window to sleep. Oh, okay. okay. He's able to rest. All right, so I might just be in the wrong parking spot. Let's see if I can find another spot. Okay. It's weird because this is the truck area. What would? How would I rest? If I, how would I know if I can rest? So you have to just turn off your engine when it mm. gives you the prompt. Yeah. Try going over here. And then what? I guess I'm not sleepy. Okay, there we go. Use the following key to stop the engine. Okay. Stop the engine. Okay, and I hit enter. And you're you're resting? I'm now rested. So I think we can get going now. Thank you for that. I don't know what was going on there. Usually it just lets you park and it's good, but that just mm. that one was finicky. Anyway, we're good. We can get we can get back on the road now. Alright, give me one second. You guys can get started. I'll uh, I'll catch up here. Convoy up. There's gonna be a lot of ska in this playlist, I'm just warning you right now. Check one, two, three, four. Hi. Did I come through on your, your gameplay? I didn't hear it. Okay, I've gotta get my thing set up. Alright, you're back on the road. Let me get going here. I'm back on the road. I'm going at a slow speed so y'all can catch up. Okay. Coming. Got any um got any main drag in this playlist? No, I don't. You're right. I should have grabbed them. I I did it kind of in a hasty fashion today. Oh, that's fine. I saw uh Saw, I saw Drake tweeting about one of their songs has gotten like millions of plays at this point on Spotify. Wow! So they probably made like a whole thousand dollars off that. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, I don't. I, I, it was more just a like fun emotional milestone thing, not as much yeah. a, like, <laughs> like we didn't exactly get rich off of this. And was it, it like, a jagged, gorgeous song. winter? It, it was, in fact, yes, it was that song. So that's a song from the Rock Band Two soundtrack. So that makes a certain amount of sense. Oh, okay, okay, that makes way more sense. Bam, 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 bam. You catching up? Uh, one second. Sorry, I'll be there in just a minute. I, I hope. Should I pull over? No, 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 no. You keep going. Okay. I was trying to see if I can get my microphone set up for this, but it doesn't seem to be in the options here. I remember we yeah. did it one time we when you and I were convoying. Yeah, and I kind of liked it because you get like all the CB chirps. Yeah. So yeah, so you keep going. Yeah. I'll, I'll catch up. Okay. Yeah, I don't have a lot of experience dealing with this uh, convoy stuff because the only time I ever convoy is when you and I play together. <laughs> I'm all about the solitude, baby. I'm all about being out here on my own. But I appreciate everyone who is in the convoy and joining up with us. Still in Montana? I think we are. You know, we know. Uh, Fun thing I, about this country is a lot of it looks the same. Okay, good. I thought I thought you were gonna do some kind of bullshit rolling stock there. Butte? Is that how you pronounce that? Butte. Butte. Yes. That's my. That's that's in Montana, isn't it? Yes, that is. Butte is in Montana. Okay. 
Like that that's kind of the, like like I said, that's kind of the big question for me with this thing, because it seems like realism is the thing. Yes. Or the distance is real. So they're on like, a scale. Uh, okay. Cause, cause so it's, it's like, it seems like there would absolutely be people out there who would want it to be to scale. One to or, one. Or one to one, yeah. yeah, rather. Yeah, that's a tall order because that's a lot of distance to have to cover. Um, but the way they do it is they kind of truncate a lot of spaces around, like, the distance you cover on a highway, obviously, is not real mileage. But they try and do an, an, you know, an equidistant thing of, like, between cities, like, how long the highways are on their scale. And the cities are pretty scaled down. Like, there's only a limited number of areas in every city you can drive through. All right, I'm, uh, I'm cruising here. Okay, I'm on Highway 212 now. All right. Riley Joe 7 says there may, in fact, be some one-to-one -one maps from modders out there. Hmm. Which is the least surprising thing I've ever heard. That also feels like lunacy, because... Have you ever tried to drive across an entire state? That takes a while. Even the smaller ones. How's your gas? I think I might need gas. I got about half a tank right now. Oh man, I should have filled up. Well, if you want to catch up to me and then we can go find you a gas station, that's fine. Okay. My gas tank is red. I might, I might just pull off at the next one here. Okay. How far back are you? Uh, hard to tell. I'm still on 90. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you're a ways. I feel like I'm coming up on Jam. Jam might have pulled over. Yeah, Jam was pulled over for a bit. I think they disconnected briefly. Okay, wait, I'm getting off 90. Okay. Well, I'm Are now you... on the 310. Ooh, gosh, this guy in front of me. Okay. All right, Ixnay is right behind me. All right. You're on 310? Yeah. All right, That's. I think that's what I'm pulling on to now. There's a train coming. There's always a train coming. Oh, I have. Rain's coming. Mm hmm Favorite road trip snack, chat asks. Ooh. Also, as some people have pointed out, I think there's a distinction to be made to, uh, between whether you're driving or not as well there. Yeah, because when you're driving, you don't want anything that's going to be messy at all. Yeah, yeah. And you don't really want something you have to look at too much. Okay, I would say beef jerky has always been a good road trip snack for me. Yeah, yes, for sure. I like combos, but um, just because I can only ever find them at like rest stops and gas stations. Mm -hmm. All right, I gotta pull in. You know what? All right, you gotta have a chance to catch up here because I gotta pull into a way station. Okay. God, now I, now I want some combos. Best combo? Ooh, I like a nacho cheese, but. Um, I'll take whatever you got. Pizza? Huh? The pizza one? No. God, I wonder how many varieties of combos are there at these least, days. Yeah, it's probably like unlimited, but there's... I remember nacho cheese, peanut butter, and um, pizza as the big one. All right, I passed the inspection. Well, that was fast. You literally just press a button. All right, I'm going to wait for Ixnay to get their... Uh, their way on. Let's see. We got a buffalo blue cheese combo. Oh my gosh. Cheddar, mm. che cheddar cheese bacon. Oh my gosh. Uh, pepperoni, of course. Pepperoni pizza, rather. Of course. Uh, there is a separate pizza Rio one that is not the same as the pepperoni pizza one. Oh, what? Spicy honey mustard. Oh, okay. that sounds delicious. Okay. That's now pretty good. Let me just click this where to buy button. Hmm. Truck stop. Of course. All right. Punching my zip code into this Combo's <laughs> uh -huh. website. Combo's website. 
Well, it stands for reason they would have a website. They do sell products. Somebody told me uh, during Halloween, when we were talking about Halloween candy, that there are pretzel M&Ms. Oh, yeah. curious. oh, you've had them? Oh, there's all. Dude, they're not. I don't. Uh, I might have had them at some point. There's all kinds of M&Ms now. There are obviously peanut and peanut butter, which are classics. Yeah. Um, there are there are caramel M&Ms now, which I was not a huge fan Oof. of. Okay. That sounds um, a bit, like a bit much. Uh, the pretzel ones, which sound very good. I might have had those at some point. Yeah. Uh, there's, um, gosh, there's another one I'm trying to think of that's not coming to mind. The Safeway near here has like a whole freaking M&M shelf. Jeez. Uh, they, they still do the little M&M man? Little M&M yeah, people? Yeah, the characters? Hey, I didn't yeah. Oh, violation. yes. I stopped. Yes, there was, yes, there was a whole controversy about them that was stupid as hell oh? earlier this year. Oh my gosh, really? Are they are they canceled? Were they not, posting on Twitter? It's not worth getting into. No, not extremely not worth getting into. Uh... Aha, here we go. Flavors. Espresso M&M's. Uh, oh, brownie M&M's. Those are the ones I was trying to think of. They have... Safeway's got the brownie M&M's, which I have not tried. That sounds delicious. Um, let's see. They've got... They've got what they call crunchy cookie M&M's. Oh, it says I can pass the way station. Maybe because you guys all went? Maybe, yeah. So we're okay. not that much further ahead of you. We just passed through a town. Okay. I still got to right. find gas. Question. Uh-huh. Yes. Well, white chocolate M&M's. How do, how do we feel about white chocolate? Oh, my gosh. I have nothing against white chocolate. I love a white chocolate. Oh. My wife my wife is like, it's not chocolate. And she takes this, like, principled yes. stance on it. And I'm like, but it's delicious. Technically, it is not. I, I don't have anything against white chocolate. I will take real chocolate over white chocolate 10 times out of 10. I feel like at Easter, we used to get a lot of white chocolate crosses and, you know, doves and things. I don't get a lot of white chocolate. Oh, ghost. At Halloween, we get a, like a ghost that was white chocolate. Let's I'm a fan, though. I dark, like a white chocolate. Man, almond M&Ms, dark chocolate M&Ms, dark chocolate mint M&Ms. <laughs> oh, boy. I think there's ever been okay first question where do you think m&ms are made somewhere in the midwest I, my, my standard answer is sort of say peoria <laughs> like i don't know i don't i don't know a magic peoria chocolate just, land i don't know where do they make chocolate i guess i don't know peoria like, is just the prototypical midwest city to me like i want to i want to see an m&m factory second thing would be like do you feel like there's a place where all M&Ms start and then they get a different flavoring or are there just different lines in in the Factorio satisfactory style of M&M making? Is there a central source that begins in M&M's life? Mm. Do they all get the final uh, coating of M&M? When can you merge would the you lanes? Would, would you believe that YouTube is rife with how M&Ms are made videos? Okay. Is this what the controversy was? Uh-huh. No. <laughs> they... They made one of the M&M's less sexy, and the, the worst people got mad about it. Oh, okay. This is probably why I don't know about it. Got it. Yeah, oh. because it's fucking stupid. Oh, no, because I only search for sexy M&M's. Oh, okay. I, yeah. yeah I well, did. it's I, not sexy anymore, so well, you're well, not going to well, find your needs anymore. are it's not being erased. met. No, I'm on private servers. Don't worry. Oh, okay. Your private M&M &M server? <laughs> yeah, I've got my own business. Uh, gosh. Wow. Is there an M&M's world near here? There's one in New York. Yeah, there used to be one like under the Toys R Us or something. Or, or like a a 24,000 square foot, three level glass box in Times Square. Yeah, I think maybe that used to be a Toys R Us. Find gas right. yet? All right. No. I mean, no. I mean, they're good. I mean, they're, I didn't wow, say they're in the upper say, echelon. Man. I mean, I'm sorry. Right. They're I, in the upper echelon of candy. I don't know if I love, like, just regular old M&Ms. I'm out of fuel. Oh, that's bad. The, uh, the, the peanut butter M&M is the king to me. 
I gotta get out and uh, fill up the tank. So there is a way to get emergency gas. I forget what it is. There's a button you I have think, to press. I think I gotta call somebody, right? You, yeah, you it's like somewhere refueling. in the um, it's somewhere in the like service menu. Yeah, I'll find it. Let's see, gas. Emergency refueling. There we go. Yeah, it's only going to cost me 400 bucks. That's probably how much it costs. It's probably cheaper than the gas. You know what I'm saying? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know how it is. You know, everybody, you guys know how it is. All right. Back on the road. Wait, Jam just okay. passed me. Jam's back. Jam's cruising. Jam doesn't have a trailer. Uh oh. Jam, Jam cut the load. <laughs> Jam, Jam lost to their trailer, I'm told. Jam. Okay. Jam's just here for the good times. The dry, somebody else has dried fruit now. Ah, the open road. Vinny, I want you to catch up. Oh, yeah, I'm going to catch up. Why don't you do, like, if you can do, like, 50, I'll keep at 65. I don't, right. think, I don't think I can go above 65 in my truck. All right, I'm going at 50 right now. Wait, I still have to get gas. I think that emergency refueling only gave me a, a, a tickle of it gas. It only gives you a little bit. Yeah, it's okay. not. It's it's just enough to get you to a gas station, hopefully. Okay, I'll have to find some gas on my way here. If I see one on my way, I will stop there because I, I okay. don't need gas, but I can get gas, and I'll just wait for you. Okay, sounds good. Maybe we cut to your feed once we do that. <laughs> I feel like I'm... I'm cutting through town a lot here there's yeah the, these smaller highways you tend to cut through a lot of towns oh okay that's oh boy. me that's me that's me i was did, did someone do a no-no i did can i go to gallon oil and get gas or i have to go to a truck stop for gas there should be a, a marker on the map it's usually like <laughs> a red icon that says gas those are the ones you can go to okay so if it's just a regular gas st station i cannot no all right Okay, my guy's yawning. Okay, you also probably need to find a rest stop at some point then. But my, my, uh, the bed is blue for me. It's not red yet. Where do you see that you're Okay, yawning? when it turns red, you're bad. Uh, I can just hear it. Oh. Can you see your character in this? I mean, I saw that photo earlier. No. There's no, I just, I just noticed there are no hands on the wheel even. Mm-hmm. That's Jesus has a hand on the wheel. It's a ghost truck. A jam. They say these old highways are full with ghost trucks. All right, jam's right behind me. We're coming. We've got a small convoy. <laughs> no, okay, Trucking jam. through the midday. Jam's in my on my shoulder here. Trucking through the late afternoon. Oh boy. I got a jam in my uh <laughs> I got a jam in my rear view. Okay. I think I might have lost Ixnay somewhere along the way. Okay. Jam, you're stressing me out, Jam. Jam. Can't be there. Jam getting a little uh friendly. Okay. <laughs> Jam has pulled back a little bit. Alright, I'm back on the road here. Oh, it's raining. It almost looks like it was raining inside the cab for a second. Is it what? What do you call it when um, you're driving and it's like fairly trafficy, but you guys, are, everybody's moving and people just cut in and out of lanes to get ahead of other cars? Oh, being an asshole. Yeah, being an asshole. Is 
if, if anybody's in our chat or has done that and there's an explanation either than being an asshole or somebody's pregnant. No, not. Is there not? Okay, because I really don't understand it. <clears throat> okay, now my thing is right here. Some people just get real weird and shitty on the road. Man. Like, is it, is it fun? Maybe it's fun. If it's fun, that's, yeah, listen. I don't think they're having fun. I think they're just very angry and impatient people. Okay, Jam, I, I gotta find a place to sleep. But I think I see both of you on the, on the road. Okay. My my big highway soapbox pet peeve is riding people's bumpers. Oh, fucking hate that. Whether whether <clears throat> whether it's being done to me behind or I'm riding with somebody who is doing it, it's cannot stand it. What's the air horn button? I need to air horn. Jam. I need to air horn you. I only have my my weak horn here. <laughs> All right. Oh, this guy got caught in the box. Don't block the box, man. Oh, I blocked the box. Can't do don't, that. Don't block the box. I don't like that. Ooh, I discovered a new viewpoint. It's raining. I'm oh, no. off here. Check this out. Okay. I don't know how to turn my wipers on. Visibility is low. Check this out. Checking. Boysen State Park, baby. Oh, you got like the scenic view? Mm hmm. Yeah, they have these like viewpoints in a lot of the new DLC of like, hey, here's a scenic thing or a thing, a landmark hmm. that you would know from this state. Are these games just like huge? Like, Define huge. I don't know, multi million sellers, I guess. Like, oh, you mean like popular? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they're they're reasonably popular for what they are. Uh, I think the big thing is that the people who are into them are way into them. Mm. Fair. Yeah. Well, yeah, that I would believe. But also, if you told me that like these games sold tens of millions of copies, I guess I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, I'm out of fuel uh, again. <laughs> Hold on, I got I got to make a phone call. All right. Uh, so, yeah, you know, let's, let's see. This game has almost uh, almost 100,000 uh, user reviews on Steam, which... It's been out for a number of years, is the thing. Like, they've been averaging, like, two or three states a year in terms of DLC. If you if you believe the ratio of user reviews to sales on, on Steam metric stuff, that's a lot of copies. I wonder if Euro yeah. Truck did better than American Truck. Well, Euro Truck also came out first. Yeah, that's true. Are they still supporting it? Yeah, they haven't put out DLC for it recently. Their next thing was supposed to be an expanded Russia DLC, which I think they might have put that one on the back burner mm, for a little interesting. while. Interesting, okay. Because right now, in the only places you can go in Russia are like straight up Western Russia. Is the question mark on the map, is that the vista? Okay, that's, that's like it, Yeah, it's usually like a viewpoint you haven't been to. Okay, so that's what I So just... I'm only just a little bit up ahead from you. Okay, you haven't seen a rest stop, have you? Not in a little while. All right. But we're about to hit another uh, highway here, so maybe something will be coming up. I wish I knew the keyboard shortcut for these wipers. I, I'm, I'm afraid of just hitting buttons because I'm afraid of releasing the trailer. Yeah, no, you I might understand. Hit or something. Yeah. Look at that pink building. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, we got a railroad crossing. We got a train coming. Hmm. All right, you'll have a chance to catch up here because I'm in a railroad track. Okay. Yep, Jam is right next to me. The next day is right behind me. Oh, I got. Uh, they want me. They really 
that jam. Oh, that was a that was a sharp one. They All right, see you guys. We're comboing up. They charged me for not sleeping. Yeah, they'll do that. Yeah. <laughs> jam, is that jam jamming on the horn? Probably. There's a cement mixer. That's not part of our convoy. I don't believe so. All right, fellas. When we see yeah. gas or we see a rest stop, we're uh -huh. stopping. Just FYI. Gas, ass, or rest stop. Nobody rides. Everyone's riding for free today, Everyone baby. Everyone rides for free. Don't worry. We only have a thousand miles to go. Whoa! Ixnay just took the uh, got off on the shoulder there. Okay. Or on the turn off. Oh, he's merging back in. Here we go. Oh, um, <clears throat> to answer a question from earlier, a number of people have said that the maps are one twentieth scale in this game. Okay. That sounds about right. And they've done some rescaling work on some of the, like the original maps they made. Like some of the California stuff was a little off when they first launched it, so they've like redone some of the cities and highways there. I have to say, it's not it's not like the most high fidelity game ever, but they sure did nail the look. <laughs> yes, for being a uh, I believe I believe Czechoslovakian developer, they have a pretty good handle on what the wide stretches of America look like. I think they just like drove across these routes and sorry, like, just check, just check. I forgot Czechoslovakia doesn't. Yeah, I would. Yes, no, that's not. Um, uh, yeah, man. If I was making a game like this, <laughs> I would just straight up dash cam it the entire way across. <laughs> mm-hmm. That it, is invaluable it's research. Like open Google okay, Maps. There's a rest stop coming up. Ah, oh, thank Reference goodness. Material. Might have to make an illegal left, but it's fine. You know, I know this has happened in some of the bigger space games, but like... Okay, here we go. There's got to be a game some point at somewhere where you have a similar mechanic to this, where we're playing this and someone else is doing a completely different thing in the game. Like, uh, I don't know, some kind of park tycoon or something where they put in an order for dried fruit for their snack, to, you know, and we're, we're fulfilling that order. They just need to combine everybody. You, you need mm -hmm. to stop. You need to stop before you describe Star Citizen. Yeah. And like I said, I think some of the space games have some of that stuff, but yeah. It's never quite the dream. All right, pull it in. All right, where are the sleeping spots? Anywhere where we're parked, you can should be able to pull up. All right. Are these spots? Yeah, pretty much. If it says foot, you stop the engine, just stop the engine there. Okay, let me pull up in front of you then. Okay. Look at us. Look at this crew. Truck crew? Are you still just at four? I think so. <laughs> I don't think it's letting me stop the engine here. Yeah, you might be a little out of the parking yeah. range. Oh boy. Hold on, let me uh, give me a sec. Mhm. Mm Whatever you got to do, man. Uh oh. We might make it, make it to Texas today, but we'll do our <laughs> Come best. Come on, we're gonna make it. I don't so, know, man. We only got like an hour. As soon as I figure out how to park this thing. I think we're still in Wyoming. Okay, it's letting me stop. I stopped. Okay. Oh, let me stop for a second. Then I think I lost it. Okay, here. Enter. All right, I'm resting. I do need gas, right. though. Is there no gas station here? Let me take a look at the map. Let's see what we got here. It looks like there is gas. Not here. 
Okay, yeah, it's. I see it. The next town up, Casper, there is a. Uh, All right. There is gas. All right. I'm going to pull out. Pull it out. All right. Casper. Just one town up. Uh oh. Some dark looking clouds. That's America, baby. Big Storms sky. Coming. Casper. Fuck off, car. I take precedence. I'm a truck. Mm. All right. Back on the road. I'm right behind you, buddy. I'm driving on fumes here. I know. Just one town up. One town up. Do 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 do. There's another question mark coming up on the map. Yeah, it's probably Ooh. another scenic overlook. T Mill 2010 says you're pretty close to Devil's Tower. Okay. That might be what this is. Oh, I'll tell you um, what, you keep going forward. Yeah. I'm going to pull off here real fast and show yeah. people what this is. Okay, that's I'm okay. Gonna, I ran out of fuel again. Okay. Yeah, I should be, I should be, I should be Google mapping this. Do you know what the next town is? Casper. Casper. Casper, Wyoming. Yeah. Let me just see. Probably no Hell's Half Acre people. is where I am. Hell's Half Acre. It sounds like something near Devil's Tower. Ooh, look at that. Damn. Are you on... Are you on 26? I might be. God, wow, Again, yeah. Hell's I Half Acre is the landmark I'm at. I-26 I runs right through where I'm from. It's, I mean, I know they are called interstates for a reason. There's... But it's still, but it's still always weird to see them that far apart. Um, I don't think your Devil's Tower would be quite a detour. If, if you're on 26, okay. passing through Casper, that's unfortunately you would have to head north. Uh, we to tried get to Devil's Tower. We tried finding the Grand Canyon once, didn't we, Alex? We did, and I think we did find it. It wasn't quite as grand in the <laughs> game, but you know, they had a limited limited space to work with. All right, I'm bringing up the rear now in the convoy, but we're all moving towards you. Okay. Where did you start, Bozeman? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Which is like southwestern Montana. Headed to El Paso, is that right? Mm hmm. Uh, yes. Let me evaluate. Right, we're now under a thousand modern... miles to our, our destination. Modern mapping technology. Mm -hmm. Got another, another question mark coming up. Sorry, we could not calculate transit directions from Bozeman, Montana to El Paso, Texas. Really? It's impossible. No one's ever done it. Oh, I'm sorry. It was set to, it was set to public transit. You don't oh, say. Think... Is this the fuel? It's green. The, the, the fuel things are green on the map. You check the map. No one saw me do that GTA shit right there, okay? Um, no one saw it. I might go check this out. It's a repair shop and a question mark. Repair shops here. don't give you don't give you fuel. Mm. Do you see the thing coming up? This like turn, the left turn coming up? Yeah. Is that is there any fuel past that? It should be in this area. Yeah. There are like side streets and stuff, so you might have to like turn down one of them to. I might go straight instead of making this left, just to take. Yeah, a look yeah, yeah. I think that's I think that's sensible. Ixnay says, "Follow me." Okay. Just bright me back there. We sort of have a convoy here. It's a little, it's a little messy. <laughs> that's not bad. Look, that's a lot of trucks. Yeah. 
Jam just kind of going off doing their own thing. That's fine. Jam. Yeah, follow Ixnay. It seems like they know where they're going. Okay. There's Jam. You can't be on an interstate if it's taking you through a town, can you? We're not on an interstate, I don't think. I think we're on a state highway. Okay. I found a Peterbilt uh, truck dealer. You know, a major yeah. landmark. Uh-huh. need to put my tea mug in my mouse hand. Beep, 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 beep. What is that? That's uh, me. What is that, 40? It's like 40 on your mini-map. I think that's the speed limit. Ah. Yes, correct. Also, I'm literally touching your butt. <laughs> Don't touch my butt. You gonna make this light? For. Yeah, I think so. Even if I don't, I will. Yeah, I'm not gonna make this light, but I don't care. I'm going. Stop me. Try hey. and stop me. We're in Casper Creek. Casper Creek. They, have, they don't have any fully electric big rigs yet, right? I was, I was no. just going to mention that earlier. I feel like I've seen a lot of stuff with that. When I was looking up the F-150 Lightning, a lot of the towing capacity for those things just dies anytime there's the aerodynamics aren't right or there's too much right. weight. The batteries just... Huh. Uh, <clears throat> um, there's a headline... Electrifying U.S. long-haul trucks will require 504 terawatt hours a year, but that won't be the hardest part. Okay. Let's just keep going. Just keep going. Just you follow Ixnay. Run the light? Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, man. You took a picture of my license plate. The outlaw plate. truckers, baby. I put Vaseline on my license plate. I wonder if you were if you were to build if I were to build the infrastructure for a trucking an electric trucking industry, I would mm -hmm. probably have it where you just the batteries that I assume would be massively heavy would just be charged and waiting for you at truck stops, you know? And you just you just pop them in so you don't have to sit and you mm -hmm. know, um, recharge a big old gigantic battery. So you kind of just put the drop off the battery, swap it out. Hopefully it takes, you know, 10 minutes because they got it all figured out. Yeah, just stacks and stacks of batteries behind the Flying J. Yeah, I mean, that sounds safe, right? Oh, gosh. Yeah. What, what is that thing called when the battery, like a laptop battery, a lithium ion battery gets so hot that it starts, uh, it keeps going. It's like runaway or something. Uh, those fires that are terrible. Yeah. Yeah, they're very hard to put out. And we're just running all the lights now, right? Okay. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, gosh. Oh, brakes. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I do believe that Ixnay is bringing us to a gas station somewhere. <laughs> I would like to think they're not lying to us. Going to rob the... <laughs> Ixnay's with the mafia. They're just going to rob the trucks. Yep. Yeah, they're taking us to a dark corner where <laughs> they can just steal all our shit, all our dried fruit. Where'd you get this dried fruit? Yeah, hey, I fell off the back of a truck. Yeah, you know, I'm getting into mangoes. Eat shit, cars. I I stopped for the cars. No. Jam, jam figured it out. Oh, jam. Oh, wow. Interesting. Germany is 
Germany is trialing shipping trucks that run off of overhead power lines, kind of like how, you know, like electrified oh, wow. buses work. Uh -huh. Oh, God. Wow, that's wild. I had a little bit of a collision. Don't mind me. <laughs> like, after doing this view mode. Back into the cab like a normal person. That sounds incredibly expensive. To run, like, overhead to, power to, lines? To, to, to build out the infrastructure for that. Mm -hmm. Well, Germany does have a little less land mass to deal with, so... Two, two, million, two million euros per kilometer of infrastructure to build that out. I feel, I feel okay, like I should, see the gas station. They should do them like slot cars, like little uh, tracks in the road that you put, you put like a little peg into as you're driving to charge up. Oh, uh, yeah, there's the gas station. Cops are so mad at me. I keep speeding. I keep running red lights. Oh, the cops just flat. <laughs> Is that the same cop that got you? Probably. Ooh, Taco Kingdom. Anyway, yes, we are pulling into the gas station now. Do you think that anybody ever actually registered 1 800 each shit? <laughs> Sure. Yes. Absolutely. Just, just to see, what, just to see what have. kind of calls, just, just to see what kind of calls would come in. Absolutely. I'm not quite brave enough to call it right now. Oh God. I need this car to move in front of me. Car, move. One day I'm gonna have to remember to uh, fix that couple my trailer button to not also be the one that shifts forward. All right, so we're all gassing up. Well, some of us are. I'm stuck. How do you gas up? Uh, you stop your engine in front of one of the, there's like a hovering green icon. Okay. For which gas ones you can use. All right, hang on, we got to back up here. I'm at the Flying J. Sheets? I'm going to fix that, this control right now. Is that another place I could fill up a truck? Uh, probably. Don't mind me. I'm just looking for that button that I should fix. Your big truck butt's in my way. Sorry. Where is that? Uh, Rack nuts and truck butts. That's this stream. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> the hell did I set that? There it is. Fixed it. Finally, it won't do that anymore. Now, can I get out of this mess? Oh, boy. Good question. Oh, boy. That's probably fine. <laughs> when I was uh, when I was looking at um, electric trucks, and they are unbelievable, ungodly expensive. Trucks are. I'm not surprised. Pickup trucks are ungodly expensive. Anyway, when I was looking at them. And I was, I, people were like, oh, you know, the hauling capacity on these is, is really a shame. I was telling my wife, and I was like, yeah, maybe, we'll, maybe I'm just going to stop, A, because it's ungodly expensive, and B, because, you know, maybe they'll figure out the battery and stuff. And she was like, you have never hauled anything in your life. Why would that why matter? Would you start to, now? Why would that matter to you? And I was like, that's not the point. She's basically like, then what's the point? What, what is, why, why do you want, why do you want I have freed this? myself. We can go. All right, wait, I still have to fill up. Okay. Where? I still don't see the gas station, Blinky. I'm just going to go. You don't see the greens? Like, basically, like, kind of look at where Ixnay oh, yeah, and yeah, yeah, a jam, yeah. is, jam is, like, right, pointing right at them, basically. Yes, yes, yes. Hold on. I do see one. But they're over here? They are. So here, let me pull up so you can get out of there. Yeah, I'm going to. Oh, yeah. That's, that's definitely the way you're supposed to go. Is that how, not how I'm supposed to go? Eh, it's fine. No one's keeping score. I'm just going to do a big old loop over here. 
That's um, that F one fifty Lightning seems like it's awfully popular. Well, that's that's the thing is like I don't know. You know, the internet makes a lot of videos, so I don't know what to take. But it seems like if you are towing something, the battery really just dies, especially if it's like a headwind. I mean, those things are just giant bricks going down the road. But those things are like they're only new, right? So there are no used ones really. But they're like eighty grand. Yeah, like, I believe it. Are they? I mean, yeah. new gas Sorry. engine trucks that big aren't that much less expensive. Um, I thought. I thought I. Let me see. I thought they started at like. I mean, you could. For the base I think you could start around sixty something, but uh, for the one with the bigger battery, they're just. So yeah, you want that I, real shit. I, I just, I just read that in this car and driver article on the 2023 model. So that the battery upgrade is hugely expensive. I think it's going to be. I mean. Knock on wood, our 2006, 2007 Prius is still, still working. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they, they, aren't the asking to, they aren't asking to buy it back anymore, though. Mm -hmm. Price on the base model of that truck went, went up $12,000 this year. Uh, no, I'm still filling up. Okay. Damn, went up, man. Went up how much, uh, Brad? Uh, 12000 Jeez. On this year's model. All right, I'm full. All right. Yeah, I'll probably no more traffic law. Not get that car. God, I time. love not having to deal with a vehicle. <laughs> we have exactly forty minutes to get to where we're going, so no more traffic law, no more rules. All we right, just go. I'm, I'm rested basically and fueled up. Let's go. Yeah, no stopping unless you're about to literally pass out or you're out of gas. According to uh, according to Auto Writer two two seven and Twitch chat, who would probably know, uh, the average average price of a new car as of July this year was forty eight thousand dollars. Oh my gosh! I, I had been reading some I've been reading some stuff about new, even new Civics start at like over forty now, which is that's just what the fuck. Insane to me. So we've been saving it's, up for a new car for about since we paid off the Prius so many like 10 years we're not near to that number I don't mm -hmm. even know now know if we're close to a down payment for that number I don't know if I would ever buy a new car well so I don't want a new car but um, I, I just want to lease a used car which I, <laughs> I don't think they yeah. do I mean, I know there are like supply and demand issues as of right now, but like the savings on a like very low mileage used car are just so huge. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've always been in the mind that like when I buy a car, I'm gonna reuse that thing until I cannot use it anymore. And my car is still in good oh, shape, yeah. so I will not be replacing it anytime soon. All right, we all on the road here? I think so. All right. Yeah, cars are bananas now. It's just... In my mind, I'm still, like, stuck at $20,000 is the average price for a new car. Yeah, that's what I thought about Civics until I looked them up, and I was like, oh... I don't think I've ever owned it, or I guess I think my family probably leased new cars. So all the I have family and some friends that leased cars before the car market went um, crazy, and mm -hmm. you know when that lease is up, you kind of lock into the price, right? And so when the lease is up, you have the option to buy out the car at the price you locked into. <laughs> and they all, I guess they. At least two of the people I've talked to just went to the dealer and like, listen, if you don't put this money towards my next lease and give me a, a real savings on this, I'm just gonna buy this car and sell it to another dealership somewhere else for the extra 10 grand that is worth now. Which uh, I guess most of the dealerships are like, okay. All right. I mean, listen, I don't know anybody who works at a car dealership, so I don't know if that's a big pain in the ass and if they're in trouble, but. For the people that were leasing the car, they were pretty happy. Hey, I mean, one of the up. biggest chuckleheads I went to high school with now is a is a car salesman, and he seems to be doing fine. Okay. I say chucklehead because he was a bit of a doofus, but also mm -hmm. I have no real problem with him. 
a car dealer seems like the exact job that guy should have. Like, what What did cars on a well-maintained car... Are we talking like 150,000 miles these days on, let's say, a car from the 2000s and up? Is that like wear and tear on a on a mod, semi-modern engine? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh? You, oh mean, gosh. you mean before you need to dump it? Yeah, before that car is like, hey, man, that thing's oh. just going to be smoking I, I on mean, the side I, of the road. I, I, obviously, it depends on the make, but like Toyotas, for example, I would always hear like 200, 250, wow. easy. Okay. Damn. Hondas, too. Man. If they're well-maintained, I'm sure. I don't even have 100,000 yeah, on my you, Subaru. Yeah, like my, my parents put like way over 200 on their Camry. That's awesome. I'm in traffic, Alex. Go Those around. years ago, maybe things have changed. I don't know. All right, I'm trying to go. Traffic is clearing up. Fuck these cars. I'm going full GTA at this point. No more All right. law. You're just trying to get there. Yeah, we just got to get there, man. We still got 800 miles to go. So the thing with this game is you can't kind of just shortcut your way, right? You do have to follow the roads. You kind of have to follow the roads. Okay. There are certain amounts of road you can drive off of, but, like, it's limited. Is this the first night? Oh, I don't know. I think we started at night-ish. It was it was only a twenty something hour oh, trip. What are you? Are you passing? Uh, what, what are we doing here? <laughs> like I said I got to get around this guy. <laughs> you couldn't, the, okay. couldn't go on the couldn't huh. go on the left. That's uh, there smooth. was someone there. So, uh, I admire the ambition. So does your truck go over sixty five? Not really. All right. What's your uh, what's your time to uh, destination? It says I will be there by 4:40 p.m. on Monday. It is currently 1:41 a.m. Monday. Okay. You've got my uh, my uh, server rails in the back of that thing, so please, I do need them this weekend. Mm -hmm. Okay. Look, I'm going as fast as I can here. That's Sorry, not to. I know this is about trucks, but mm -hmm. as we discussed, uh huh. Rack uh, nuts. A rack, a rack is a spiritual truck. Uh huh. <laughs> uh, do you have anything? In, do you have anything in your rack that is not rackable, like a like an old tower PC, or like I know some people will stick like an old UPS in there or something? Like no, everything is is um, rack form factor. I mean, I have a shelf in there, so I could put stuff on, but nothing's in there now. Yeah. Like anything that doesn't, like uh, what is it? The edge router. I had to buy those big wings, the ears for yeah. it, so that it could, it could rack. Right. Yes. Oh man, Bunny Fiend is in the chat. Bunny Fiend has a toaster oven. <laughs> Wait, in, in the rack. <laughs> in their rack. That's pretty great. Wait, so you don't want to add heat to your rack? I don't, I don't know why, but that's. <laughs> for, like, why not? Can't, can't knock it. So soldering or for like delicious I don't know. reheating Who knows? pizza. Like doing like chip soldering. Oh, oh man, I soldered something last weekend and did not properly ventilate and mm -hmm. got stinky. Uh, forgot that I was using some 20 year old lead solder. Uh huh. Just don't eat it. You'll be Probably. all right. Probably, probably not the smartest thing. It's really that um, the rosin that you're, I feel like, mostly inhaling, which is disgusting. And mm -hmm. burn that stuff that burns your nose. Oh, you don't think it puts much lead in the air? No. 
I mean, listen, I'm not a scientist, but there's a lot of debate on that stuff online. The, the smoke that comes off is mostly the flux, I think. Okay. Okay, that's good. Is, is my understanding. If you're using rosin core solder, is my understanding again. That. A lot of people don't like that um, the silver solder. They still want to use the the lead solder. Higher melting points. My favorite still using the same silver solder. <laughs> yes, I'm I'm still using the same iron and solder that I bought in probably '99 to mod original PlayStations with. Okay. Huh. Uh huh. Does it have a temperature control on it? No. Okay. <laughs> Great. It was the cheapest thing that Radio Shack had. Oh, is it that one with like the gray and the it's the black handle with the gray on it near the top, and then it's just it's just a it's wand. Here. I can. I mean, I can, I can get it out. I got my eyes on the road. I think we are, if not in Colorado, we are near it. Okay, I'm making pretty good time now. Yeah, we're booking. Oh gosh, until I hit the wrong button. I meant to hit the cruise control, just turn my engine off. Oh, get moving. It's okay, your momentum will carry you for a little bit at least. Uh, I have 804 miles. I have 779. Okay, you're a little ahead of me. All right, yeah. I think we're in Colorado now. No, we can save this. <laughs> I know you're busy. I can uh, here, hold it up. I can see out of the corner of my eye. I can, uh, return. Okay. Yeah. So I, can, like, I can't see it, it too well, but it's it, blue. It is literally, yeah, but it is literally just plugged into the wall and go. Okay. <laughs> not, not a whole lot to it. I replaced two. <laughs> two LEDs in my kid's star projector this weekend and felt like a fucking champ. <laughs> like, Hell took, yeah. the whole, took the whole thing apart, had two LED, blue LEDs in a in like one of those little bin drawers um, mm -hmm. and put it back together and was like, man, another thing saved from the landfill. Yeah. In, um, in what? What were the <laughs> LEDs in? A star projector. Ah. It was oh, part sure. of the, the nebula part. The actual stars are like a self-contained little laser thing that I could not repair if I needed to, but there's like a little nebula that happens uh, and it's got like six LEDs. Fixing stuff. Fixing stuff, gotta love it. I I broke I broke one of the wires on some little battery powered fairy lights last weekend and I just went, because they're so damn cheap on Amazon. I was like, ah, fuck it, I'm just gonna buy some new ones. And then <laughs> my girlfriend was like, what are you doing? Why don't you just fix them? Yeah, that's the, see, that's the thing. And I was like, yeah, you're right. I should take out the solder stuff. Instead, I just stripped the wires and soldered it back together. And, yeah. I literally have this flashlight thing on my desk here that I had to get the battery, the battery, rechargeable battery pack has gone on it that I was like I wonder how much it costs to just buy the part number which is roughly about the price of the flashlight it was like 10 bucks maybe and the flashlight was like 20 and I was like ah but I then it doesn't have to go in a landfill mm -hmm. so I just bought the battery back but I found him uh oh I need to go to an inspection do you pass the way station Alex uh, I was unable to bypass it, but if you need to stop, fuck it, go. 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 We're, out, we're outlaw truckers, baby. I, I, I passed the one, it. The, the big one for me was like, if, if I fix these, I don't have to wait two days to, to put up new lights. I can do it there in 30 minutes. That's right. And you're not adding to the landfill, which uh, yeah. every time I throw something away now, I just feel bad about it. Here, here's the ancient solder. It's uh, 60, 40, 10 lead, I believe. Okay, yeah. Is it what uh, gauge is common. it? Does it say the like point, point zero uh, one or point? Uh, mm, this says, is that the same as diameter? I assume yeah. DIA is diameter. Point, point oh five. Okay, so it's pretty thin. Yeah. I can't remember if point oh five is thin. Maybe 0.02 is thin. I'm not good with measurements. Let's 
says the man who is about to build something wood for me out of precise measurements. See? I just, uh, cut three times. Mm hmm. As the, as the old saying goes. Bacon Monk, I'm uh, passing on your left here. Solder station is like way up there on my list of things I would do if I had a garage. Oh, yeah. Dedicated space, like nice little grabby arms and all that yes. stuff. Yes. Magnifying glass. <laughs> oh, no, God. no magnifying glass. No, what are you living in the past? You get one of those um, uh, electronic uh, magnifiers. It's like a basically a microscope with a big screen on it. That's what I got. They're awesome. Huh. Yeah. Wow. They're not that expensive. They're but they're they're awesome because you just put the circuit board under it and it's just a screen that you can solder Man. and look at. Man. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. I think we're driving through Denver. Well, I'm in Denver. I wouldn't call it driving. Uh-huh. I am cruising though. All right, 712 miles to go. I'm at 677. All right. How high is the water, mama? 600 miles. Five behind road. rising. <laughs> I wonder if this thing is totally accurate down to the street level. I wonder if I wonder if all these exit numbers and, and street names and everything are right, or if they like. So they don't include every exit, and um, yeah, sure. There are I mean, the selected are streets and blocks and areas, but there's a lot of stuff they truncate. Yeah, I, I just mean the stuff that is here. I wonder if all these streets are real street names, or if they just made some of them up. You think they might have some street names. I, they don't use like if it's like an arena or something. They won't use the official name, obviously, because they can't. I don't think. Right. Like the license, the the brand. Yeah. Uh, I wonder if they'll ever do the Northeast. I feel like that's a lot trickier and denser. The streets. It's denser. Yeah. It's, and I don't think you can sell some of those states individually because who the hell is going to pay for Rhode Island individually, you know? Yeah, right. They'll ah, just sell the it Delaware back. DLC. That's the one I'll skip. <laughs> Have they said, like, their whole plan, their plan is to do the whole United States? I mean, that is the goal, but, I, you know, how they're going to go about it past a certain point is not really known. The next one up is Oklahoma, so that's where they're at. I mean, you're definitely, if they do, going to do, like, the San Francisco to Boston trip you've done, or... Oh, uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, as soon as that's available, buddy, I'm, mm. I'm all over it. I always wanted to try for something like an extra life, the uh, like a real time big drive like that in a game. That mm -hmm. the closest to when I was looking it up that I could ever find was the um, Gran Turismo like the desert bus thing. No, oh, like the Gran, Gran Turismo. Okay. Yeah, Gran Turismo had like a, I forget what it's called though. There's big endurance races, oh, like gosh. Cannonball Run type shit. Uh, I think it was just like a around a tr track, but you just go forever. Mm -hmm. The Le Mans. Yeah, I, was, I, was well, just I, I know people. I know people who have done a virtual twenty-four hours of Le Mans. Oh, really? Like, kind of like, seems kind of actually, kinda awesome. Actually, driven it for real. Oh, right. Yes, it's an iRacing thing. It's like a whole scheduled thing. I mm. think. I think Gran Turismo have one once. That's what I remember yeah. years and years ago. Just gave bomb. about it. Just That's definitely the, the kind line. of thing they would do. <laughs> We're going to get sunrise soon. Yeah. It's uh, almost 5 a.m., so yeah, it should be coming up here momentarily. Get that outdoor view so people can see when it happens. Do you know if this game does seasons? I mean, it has okay. weather. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if it's really specific about like when it decides snow is going to exist or whatever, but. Okay. Like if this game could pull in some of the flight sim stuff with weather and all that, that'd be really neat. But I, I, I do feel like flight sim version of this game is the next big advancement, Ooh. but we're probably a ways from that. 
Dynamic weather is something that I have been thinking about would be cool to see modeled in open world games. I don't mean dynamic in the sense that like, hey, we have five weathers and they can trigger randomly. You mean like simulated somehow the weather system is simulated? Yeah, yeah. Like, I mean it would have to it would have to be very simplified, of course, but like something something a little more approaching realistic dynamics there. Like somebody shows like a low pressure system coming in. Kinda, yeah. Like Link feels it in his knees. Uh oh, Inceptor says that is in Microsoft Flight Simulator. What isn't in that game, man? <laughs> Well, but but are they pulling that data from like actual weather? Like, I wonder if they're just pulling forecasts there. And okay, yeah, it sounds like it sounds like they're probably pulling the existing forecasts from the real world. Yeah, the real weather's in there, but I don't think they're modeling the the actual pressure system. Like the yeah. phys what physics. is real weather? How do you define right. real weather? You know, like you know, like something like Horizon. You probably just got like, there's like a storm. Type, right, right. I mean, it's kind of the mm -hmm. same intensity and, and all that stuff every time it triggers, like something that was a little more dynamic. I feel like if that's going to be in a game, it's probably going to be based around some weather mechanic that you would then need to use for game. They just wouldn't put it in the background yet, right? It would be like, oh, yeah, it's, a, it's a sailing wouldn't. game, or you have some kind of weather powers, or oh gosh, I'm going to just go around all this traffic. Go. Sun's coming up. How's our convoy doing? Are you uh you alone out there? Me and Jam are up here. Okay. Where's Ixnay and Bacon Monk? Are they still in? I haven't Don't seen them in a while. Okay. I haven't seen them in a bit. Or the other the other thing is that you get a speed tree esque, like somebody comes up with some weather middleware or something. Mm. That people license. It's a little hard to look for the sun and also drive, but I'm <laughs> trying to find my my way to it. Ooh, jam! Jam's just stunting out here. <laughs> <laughs> a man does not give a fuck. He's got he's got to get that that drive 100 yards in oncoming traffic achievement. <laughs> he's got to get his kudos. Your speed as GPS All person. Right. Under 550 miles to go. Okay. As long as one of us gets there and makes the delivery, that's all that really matters. You think you're going to make it? I think I can make it if oh. I just uh, keep hauling ass. You are hauling. Is that what's in the back of your truck? I wish. Gosh, I really, really, really wish I knew how to turn my wipers on. Uh, do you, There's can I the like, sun. Oh, man. Is it raining by you? Yeah. Might have, to stop and, might have to have a nap here sometime soon, but... Is your nap nap icon blue? It's pretty blue. How's your gas? Uh, I'm at half a tank. Low. I will probably have to stop for gas at some point. Oh, but I'm making such good time. Okay, there's gas and a rest stop coming up. I'm pulling off. Okay. It's on the left. At about uh, 508 miles to the destination, that's where the rest stop and gas station is. I'm gonna hop over there real fast. All right, I just I just passed exit 50. I'll, I'll keep an eye out.
Have you been using your cruise control or have you been just keeping the pedal down? I've been using cruise control. Nice. Like it. That's what it's there for. Yeah, cruising. In the future, when uh -huh. the uh, when the self-driving cars are a little more self-driving, uh -huh. if, if they get a speeding ticket, do you think you can sue the manufacturer? I mean, that won't stop anyone from doing it, <laughs> whether they can or not. All right, I'm passing exit 13. I think I'm catching up to you. Okay. Was it on? Was it on your left? Well, the, the, the station was on the left, but the exit's on the right. Okay. Oh, yeah, I think I see here. All right, I'm going to pull off Damn, as well. that is a pricey fill-up. Yep. Oh, thank you, Toxic Antidote, for the wipers button. Oof. P. Did you find Does the, the trucker? One? Yeah, they told me, yeah. Does the trucker have to front that price does it get reimbursed how does that work it i believe a lot of it is reimbursal based which is not optimal but it is the way of the contractor oh i can't get out of here now <laughs> what am i stuck on oh everything got it oh my guy's tired too i might see if i can rest at this uh Thing. Did you rest? I haven't yet because I'm stuck in this gas port. <laughs> My booty's stuck. I've been there. I'm just gonna try backing up here. See if maybe I can straighten out a little. At the Waffle Topia? Is that where you are? There might be a Waffle Topia here. I wasn't really paying attention. All right. All right, I made it past the part that I was stuck in. Now, let me see if I can go find a place to rest. Okay, filling up. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Here we okay. go, I can rest over here. 423 dollar fill up. I am resting. All right, this is gonna be straight on, man. Straight on from here. No more rest stops, no more nothing. We're going. Oh, I think I also got stuck in this gas station. What? No, that could never happen. <laughs> I don't know what I just banged into. It's probably not important. All, All right, right, boys. So you, you're rested. You're going. I'm going. All right. Let me rest. Make it a break for the border. Catch up. Yeah, you go for it. I'm gonna go just rest in the same spot you just rested in. Nice. I'm not too far away from you. Yeah. No, we're right next to each other, pretty much. Yeah. You want me to wait? No, 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 you go, you go. All right. I'm going. Oh, boy. We got this, we got this. Why I'm gonna turn? I'm going to take a shortcut. I might be ahead uh -huh. of you. All right. I look forward to seeing how that works out. Yeah, it didn't work out too okay. well yet. And here we go. 500 miles to El Paso. That's probably a country song. <laughs> All right, I got jam over here. 15 minutes to do it. We can do this. All right. I think I, I have, jam was able to take the shortcut I tried to take, but it wouldn't let me. Okay. But I, I'm not too far behind you. You're on 25, right? Yeah. All right. I've joined you. Bacon Monk flickering oh. in and out here. Ghost truck. 
Yeah, I think that's Bacon Monk. I don't know what's going on there. Maybe having some server issues <laughs> or something. Bonk. Oh, hopefully I didn't break my car during my great shortcut. Pull in for a vehicle inspection at the nearest way station. Sorry, Fuck cannot, it. cannot do. Alex Sucks got that way station bypass service. I did. Got to pay extra for that. <laughs> We're going to lose money on this trip. Eh, the money's not really that important. No, it was never about the money. No. Okay, cruising here. I'm putting on the uh, cruise control. I drink my tea. We are cruising down the highway. Uh -huh. We are cruising along at Next Lander. Thank uh -huh. you to all our patrons who voted for this yeah. and other, those who didn't as well. Had a nice, um, never been a better podcast yesterday recording with mm -hmm. uh, Abby and Bacalar were there. Always fun to talk to those to those two. Some good th post Thanksgiving conversation and some um, uh, general <laughs> Bacalar general nonsense. Bacalar hockey stories. A lot of fun. Mm -hmm. As you get Bacalar on a podcast, hockey's going to come up. It's just the way it works. I mean, apparently the Devils are doing all right. They're good this year. That's what he says. I can verify they are. I have no reason to lie to you. <laughs> Jam's just, uh, again, stunting up ahead of me. <laughs> He's kind of deciding the whole road is his domain. There's a helicopter in the air. Oh. Well, that's where it should be. It's when it's on the ground that you have a problem. What was Kudos? Is that Project Gotham? Um, yes. Yeah, Metropolis. Also, did Metropolis have like build kudos? up Kudos? That might have been the first one. Yes, Metropolis was the first one with Kudos, and then I think they put it in most of their stuff. Where is Pro Crazy Project Taxi has something. Crazy boat. They had their own version of it. Oh, it's well, it's long gone, sadly. Yeah. Yeah, so the studio just, closed just like, a long time ago. Yeah, just like just like bizarre. Sadly. Now, if you want your driving kicks, all you got are the, you know, the big first party ones. You got your need for speed and you got this. Where is Stephen Cake Brad? Yeah, that's the real question. I know, I know he was making mobile games for some time. Uh, Working in the mobile game mines. No, no offense to other people who have made Geometry Wars games. I actually think three is better than most people seem to think. But man, I would love it if he made a new thing like that. Oh man, his Re banner Re on Twitter right. is his banner on Twitter is a giant screenshot of Jamish Wars 2. Aw. Uh, I don't know what he's up to these days. Crypto. Well, I'm, on, I'm on his website. Oh, God, I hope not. Hi, I'm a contract game programmer with 19 years of professional experience. Like he did some work on Apex. Okay. Feels like a lot of people have had a cup of coffee working on Apex in the last few years. A lot of people we know. Geometry Wars 2 never came out on anything else, did it? I don't think it did. I don't think it ever got a PC. I don't release. think so. Yeah, wow, just 360.
Okay, this song is funny. This is a song by the band None Above All that I was in, which I, I guess maybe I haven't actually said this publicly. We broke up a few weeks ago, so I'm no longer in oh. that band. Uh, but this is a cover of that song by another band that we know that is on an EP that we did, the split EP we did together. The other band is called Enziguri. So is it a, at some point it, I was going to have to say that we broke up. So here I'm just saying it now. Uh, so it's official. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just we lost momentum through the pa the pandemic and people's attentions got drifted elsewhere. So mm. nothing, no, no, no acrimony. Just you know, didn't wasn't going to keep going. So. Oh wait, I got to turn here. <laughs> Bye, car. Oh. <laughs> well, hey, look. Sometimes you have to make a, a quick decision. Sometimes you also have to just blow right through that stop sign. Mm hmm. Fiend. I take it as more of a stop suggestion. Do you have, um,. Two recorded albums that you're on, or one recorded? Four? I was never on an. So I did some vocal backups on that EP, but I was never on any other recordings for. Uh, okay. And above all, we were working on a record, and it just you know, we had like 17 songs that were like done or close to done, mm. which is a bummer. But at least some oh. of those songs that were written by our bass player, I'm sure he will probably use in his other band, which he's been still playing with so which I say Godspeed alright I'm on highway 84 now about 340 miles to go okay we I'm might uh, go a little past our, our deadline here if that's okay <laughs> I'm uh I'm getting on the same taking the same exit you are okay My truck's a little damaged. Mine too. It's fine. Okay. Uh, no one's my, gonna. No one's gonna judge you for it. Well, my engine cuts out every once in a while. It's fine. <laughs> Just kick it. It'll be fine. We made a lot of progress today. That was. What did we start at? It like twelve hundred miles, thirteen hundred miles. It's been a while. Yeah. Oh man, there's a. Did you pass this accident with the ambulance and stuff? Oh no, I missed that. I wonder if that's the car I, I, <laughs> I fucking destroyed on my way. <laughs> Maybe, I just passed by a scene of a crime. Alright, looks like we're going on Highway 40 here. I think you're about 30 miles ahead of me, which is not okay. insignificant. No. Two trailers? Who would ever heard such an extravagance? Okay, so you were on 84 and now you're getting on 404? Uh, I'm on 40. 40, okay. But not for very long, because I'm about 40. to get on to, I think, 66. Ah, uh, so many hours of my life on I-40. Alright, I'm on even ass, Route 66, I wonder, I wonder, baby. Like, how much, how much downtime does the average trucker get between hauls? Oh, man. If I remember correctly, like, the real long-haul guys, like, they would usually go out for, like, a couple... To a few weeks at a time, but then they would come back for like a roughly equal amount of time, just not working. Huh, interesting. I mean, it's, I'm sure it's different for everybody and depending on what company you work for, but there was definitely like a lot of like, you're on for this amount of time and then you're off for a while, if I remember correctly. Oh, Wolfbane says they have mandatory long breaks. Okay. I guess 
that makes okay, sense. We're under 300 miles now. Okay, so there's no way to fix your truck up without getting towed? Or by going to a repair shop. Okay. It's not like there's no, like, um, like emergency Like refuel. just shove money into your engine to fix yeah. it? No. Yeah. Sadly. Okay. All right. Let's see if they can get these dried fruits where they need to go. Like the car's making my truck's making a bad sound. Oh boy. Yeah. Doesn't really want to go above 55. You literally can't drive 55. Cannot. Man, there's some debris oh. on this road. Tanuki Tom on the Discord apparently has done this job. Like, still does, but not. Not long haul, not cross country, if I'm reading this right. Okay, or regional. So I guess if you got any questions. Are you happy? <laughs> is it a good? Is it a good lifestyle? Can you still make a good living doing it? Is the question I think I have. He said he says he's local now and home daily. So. Okay. I would I would guess much happier, <laughs> getting to be home every day. Whoa! Get out of my way. Uh, mm. Look. Look, man, I got places to be. Yeah, it's a He's tried roots. Yeah. People are going themselves. to die if they don't <laughs> get this fruit. <laughs> Jam continuing to mm -hmm. just go for it. See if we can outrun this train. Starting, starting to think some of Jam's strategy is maybe running off on me a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, we got a place to be in a limited amount of time to it. It's three o'clock now, okay? Uh huh. It's true. We do have a meeting this afternoon. Yeah, we, we have one of us has to at gotta... least. <laughs> well, we have an hour until that meeting, so but I don't think it's going to take that long. I think I think I think maybe 15, 20 minutes more at max. I hear the railroad crossing. I outran the, the, outran the train, so today's a win, as far as I'm concerned. Ooh, biplane. Do some north by Ooh. northwest shit. <laughs> um, you, uh, you all right? I don't think uh, that one was on me. Cargo, it'll be fine. Oh, wait, was that his cargo? Uh, well, <laughs> folks, uh -huh. Jam uh, oh, seems man. to have gotten themselves into a bit of a jam. Jam, jam, jam Jam's a little jammed up at the moment. Uh -huh. <laughs> wait, who's, uh, sorry, who's cargo? <laughs> America's. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Jam, it was nice knowing you, buddy, but uh, I got somewhere to be, so uh, <laughs> peace and love, brother. Uh, is Kenworth's not getting their shipment of <laughs> discount lamps today. Nope. Uh, that did some damage. I don't know whose fault that was, and I'm not going to point any fingers. I'm just going to keep on moving, keep on trucking. Let me know if you see Jam on your way <laughs> past me. Okay, we will do. I don't think he's getting out of there anytime soon. Uh, I have family friends um, in this neighborhood. They're moving truck 
flipped over. The driver is okay. Oh no! Ooh, but, but their uh, their grandmother's furniture not as okay. The fine china. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just, I don't know if I could ever trust movers. I don't know if I could ever trust having my stuff out of my sight for that long. Mm. There's too I've many done things it. that can happen. It worked out. I think I'd feel like I would rather just sell off or donate everything that I can live without and just get it small enough that I can do it myself. That compact lifestyle. Yeah, what are you going to do with that, <laughs> that coffee table? Mm, coffee table's probably not the move. <laughs> Strap that shit to the roof, man. That's coming with you. Let's put some wheels it's on been it, a drive good, it. It's, it's been a good run, but... God, actually, I can't even imagine trying to move that thing with that glass top. Oh, well... Did you find jam? I... Only in spirit. Uh-huh. You found the area they're haunting? Oh no, Vinny! <laughs> Just uh Oh no, Vinny! What happened? Uh, I, uh... Um, hmm. Boy, our well, convoy's we'll dropping, dropping like flies. Like flies. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you gotta make it, Alex. All right, 190 miles. I can do this. I'm so close. Which means we are nearing the end of our stream, and apparently we're at the end of Vinny for today. <laughs> Ix Day is passing by. Uh. Someone just dropped a big leg on his truck for the one, two, three. <laughs> he ain't getting back up. Let's see if uh, what happens if I talk to a service station here. Okay, you can honk all you want, cars. I'm literally on my side. I don't think honking is going to help here. No. All right. I'm calling a service. Go service. Oh, my current delivery will be canceled. All right, I'm keeping the spirit alive. I don't know if anyone else is still on the server or if anyone else is still going here. If I'm the last one, I will make the delivery. There's nothing to be done. I'm a mere 172 miles from my destination. <laughs> you have to make it, Alex. I, I'm I think, going to. I think there's nothing to be done. For next lander, for the patrons, I will do this. My engine's not happy. I don't care. I'm going to keep going. Uh oh. <clears throat> it's all falling apart. That's <laughs> what happens when you cross the Texas border. Everything falls to shit. Maybe somebody the will ram it. Red. I'm not sure what to make of that. Only 160 miles. You got this. I got this. Day. <laughs> Big wide open country. Oh, man. oh god. Wait, don't We're fall. Fine. <laughs> okay. We're fine. We're fine. Ooh. No more camera switches for a bit. Yeah. I'm living a high risk lifestyle out here. I, that, that, that big dollar figure, I assume, is your payout? No, that's how much money I have in the bank. Oh. Like, from other jobs I've done and playing. I don't even remember what the payout for this is. It's not really the point. <laughs> Ooh, Alamogordo. Boy, I am... You're dead. Dead, dead on the street here. Just dead, dead? Yeah. I didn't realize if you flip, you're just done. I mean, it makes sense. It makes sense. Yeah. I'm just going to join you over here. Oh, while well, my car just kind of melts into the ground. Mm-hmm. Hey, you gave it a good run. Yep. Well, I was uh, 230 miles away. 
Only I will know the true taste of Texas. And those dried fruits. The mesquite flavor. Did you both have dried fruit? Yeah, we're doing the yeah, same job. Yeah, we all run. have the same job. What happened to Ixnay? Ixnay oh, passed, yeah. they passed me by. Hmm. So they're somewhere back there. Yeah, yeah. I saw a bacon monk disconnected a while ago. They were kind of dipping in and out for a while, so I don't know, maybe they're having connection issues. Is this game decently controllable with a gamepad? So yes. Old, man. Yes, definitely. That's what you're using, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm using a 360 controller. Fucking bus. Explosivo asks if we're going to play any more Dark Tide. Apparently, they say the patch today like doubled frames per second if you don't use ray Ooh. tracing. That's not pretty good. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so I yeah, would like to play more of that stuff game. Seemed not great, but if they fix some of that, that's great. I would like to play more of that game, but I, man, I wish it had crossplay because some of the people that I would be likely to play it with might be on Game Pass. But we were on the Steam version. I think, I think they said they haven't ruled out crossplay yet, but it's not exactly in the roadmap. I don't know. I mean, I'm sure it's in their benefit, right? To, to pool all the people playing, to keep those servers yeah. healthy. Yeah, for like, sure. Just well, hard. Yeah. 100 miles. You got this. Straight just shot, baby. Just don't flip your trailer. I was also, even from what I've played of it, kind of wondering if there's actually a lot of replay value in those missions, though. Mm. Which I'm not 100% sure there is. So there's those achievements that get you the cosmetic stuff, so maybe doing them and just, like, making a list of um, in-mission achievements to pull off, like sniping or... I forget what they were. Oh, we're so close. You can taste it. Are you going to manually try and uh, put your trailer in? I'll do the simple parking, not okay. the complicated. Because there's three tiers. The skip it entirely, there's the simple parking, and then there's the do you want to back that shit up. Wait, Jam, come back. Tip me over. Jam! Oh, Jam got back on the road? I just saw Jam pass me by. Jam, you can do this. Flip me over. Turn your car around, Jam. Bye, Jam. We're so close. 69 Stop. miles. Knock me over. Flip me. Flip me for real. El Paso has been discovered. <laughs> nice. Finally. <laughs> Just uh -oh. imagining the World of Warcraft you discovered this area mm -hmm. sound. I think Jam is coming back here. I'm going to switch over. We're going to see if Jam can flip me back on my wheels. Okay. Come on, Jam. I'll holler once I get to the delivery spot. Okay, Jam, you got this. Give me the flip. This is Everything's been leading up to this, Jam. Come on, Jam. Show me what you got. Oh, wow. Come on, Jam. Come on. Oh, I thought it was going to go for a second. Uh... All right. Try the, try the, try the truck. Try the truck. Here we go. Oh, all right. This is a uh, detached trailer. You got it. What is the detached trailer button? Is it F? It was T for me, but. Okay, here we go. I don't know if I set that manually or not. I've hit, I've hit T. I don't know if I could do it. Yeah, you might be in a position where some things are malfunctioning. Okay, I've hit T. Come on, Jam. Just, uh, just a heads up here, Alex may be reaching his destination in the next, like, 90 seconds or so. Okay. It'll take me a second to pull up on it, so, but I'll, I'll holler once I'm, like, getting right there.
GM. Finding the angle. GM's finding an angle. Uh-huh. <laughs> Terrifying. How's okay. that going over there? It's okay. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, is it not detached? Oh. Okay. My, my. Hmm. I feel like you would have had it if this thing were detached. It's good. Good attempt, Jam. All right. I'm about to get off the highway here. It's going to take me a second to okay. roll up on there, but I'm getting close. Oh. Oh, yeah, you're underneath it. You got this. <laughs> okay. My trail, my truck is 100% damaged. That's not um, good. No, I that's, think that's that, not a number you want. <laughs> that's all right. We're going to switch back to Alex. Thank you, Jam, for the effort. Oh. <laughs> it's just. Wait, what the hell? Oh, it's just. This. <laughs> it's, it's gone bad. <laughs> Okay. All right, I'm six miles. I'm, I'm right. like right We're there. We're taking it over. <laughs> Thank you, JM. It was a good effort mm. all around. Six miles. Mm -hmm. Thank you, JM. So how many so how many states are in this thing? So it's the entire western United States, kind of along the Montana, Wyoming, Colorado, New Mexico border, and then a little bit east is Texas, and that is as far as they've got. Oh wow, really? Yeah. And how long? Hasn't this, this has been out for twenty fifteen? Sixteen, yeah. Jeez, wow. That's ah, a big country. Ooh. It is, and I mean again. Pandemic, development slowed. Each new state is a whole thing. It requires its own development cycle. But you know, honestly, they've gotten to where they are faster than I thought they were at their initial pace. So I'll give them credit for that. Are they still adding stuff at Euro Truck, or is that basically done? The last thing they added was the Iberian Peninsula, so like Spain and Portugal, um, and that was last year. I think they are they are still putting stuff out, but it's at a much slower pace there. Oh, there's a two. I didn't realize there was a, a second Euro truck. Well, two is the one that everyone plays. I think one was like very much a proof of concept kind of game. Two is the one they've been like actively developing for for a long time. Oh yeah, I don't I don't know if one is even on Steam. Yeah, it is. Oh wow. Okay. Yes, they didn't even put out DLC for for the first one. And when American came out, it was just California uh, and Nevada, and then they added Arizona's free DLC like around launch, and then they started charging for every state after that. I love that I'm using my blinker despite the fact that I am just straight up busting <laughs> ass through this stoplight. You're there. You, I know it's I can see it. Destination will be on the left. We. Yep, this looks like Texas, all right. Where is it? Where are you got? You're in El Paso. I'm in the El Paso area, yeah. I'm in El Paso elsewhere. I will not be stopping here. Fuck you, bus. I got places to be. We got to end this stream soon. No time for viewpoints. Got to go. I'm going to oh, check the viewpoint the, uh... is in this place.
Oh god. Airport. Oh, this is like cargo ship. Let's try first. Got Let's try first. Got places to be. Yep. All right, here we go. Pulling up. Only about 17 minutes late. I'll take it. <laughs> That's not bad. 17 minutes. Yeah, considering where we started. Yeah, and how fast you were going at the end there. All right, let's play it safe. See where they want me to park it. Done. I can do this. Might put on the old Whoa. drone cam for parking. Just got to get the trailer in these lines. I think we're going to do it. Oh, yeah. There we go. Delivery made. How much did you get? Only a few demerits. We're okay. Uh-huh. Did you get 50 grand for that? Si almost 60 grand? Looks like it. Nice. It's a big haul. And some experience points? Yeah. Maximum fuel economy. Oh, my gosh. Wait, does, does this all okay. roll up to a server? Well, it just kind of rolls this into my save, but yes, I mean, I am on a server here, so. Oh, all right, let's like see what this. Thinking with some central thing. The world of truck server, yes. Right. Okay. Let's see what this is about. I got to know. What is this viewpoint at the airport? <laughs> Welcome to El Paso Airport. This is one of the only landmarks in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> Mostly notable for being the airport they mentioned in No Country for Old Men. <laughs> wow, looks great. It's pretty scenic. Love it. It's pretty scenic. Well, folks, I think that's going to do it for today. We got a delivery. It got done. You did it. I think it. Uh, uh, Ixnay might still be on the road. I don't okay. know. Yeah, I'll check that. Let me check the maps. Wait. Oh, wait, they were right there. Did they pull in behind you? Yeah, yeah, they were right behind. Oh, I hear Alex them honking. I hear them honking. Uh, yeah, no, it, it, yeah, they were they were like literally right behind you. So did we get two deliveries yep. in? I think we did. Right there. Yep, there they are. Oh, Ixnay. nice. Let's check in on our convoy. There's Ixnay. There's Alex over on my side. <laughs> we've got we've got Jam trying to tip me over. It's just not <laughs> happening. Bacon Monk was there for a while. <laughs> Thanks to our convoy. Thanks to our patrons. You can go over to patreon.com slash nextlander. Join the, the nextlander convoy. Oh, it looks like we could get a flip. I don't know if it's going to happen, but uh, we've got to go. We've got to get ready for some other stuff for some fun meetings, meetings and greetings. But uh, everybody have Friday a great meetings. weekend out there. Keep your tires on the road. Um, Stay horizontal Lots to the tires. Kick the tires, big daddy. Uh huh. Have a good time. Thanks, Alex. Mm hmm. See everybody. Bye.